Kelly, does your mom know where we're going? No. Kelly, there's a pool. <laughs> I'm Haley. I'm Kelly. I'm Lexi. And we've all had experience with texting and driving. Between 2012 and 2019, there were nearly 26,004 fatalities due to distracted driving. How often do you see texting and driving? Um, so I see uh, texting and driving quite a bit, um, and not every time in my you know, conducting a traffic stop for someone who's texting and driving, but I'll just see it like at intersections and stuff. You'll see someone on their phone, then they'll look over at me and hurt and put their phone down. Um, but obviously, uh, quite a bit, you'll always see someone on their uh, cell phone driving down the road. 29% of drivers admitted to texting while driving. How often do you get on your phone while driving? I only get on my phone a little bit while I'm driving. What do you do on your phone? Uh, I usually just look at it, see who's texting me. Maybe it's just like, text alone, I'll just look at it, but if it's like Snapchat, I won't look at it. 39% of drivers admitted that in the month prior they had read a text or email while driving. Do you know the risk of texting and driving? Yeah, I mean, you could like crash and die and like get in trouble. Do you still do it? Uh, every now and then, like if I feel like something's important, but I try to use my text to speak. Nearly all of the drivers recently surveyed by AIA believe texting or emailing while driving is a serious or very serious threat to their safety. Five distracted seconds at a speed of 55 miles per hour is the same as driving the entire length of a football field with your eyes shut. What are safer options to avoid texting and driving? Um, so yeah, obviously, um, you can put your, um, I know there's a new feature on cell phones that you can put on like focus driving to where uh, you don't receive text messages as you're driving. Um, also, if you gotta make a phone call, text message, anything like that, just pull over. Um, five snippers safe, um, whether you need to pull in a parking lot. Um, make sure you're safe about pulling off or off side of the road though, because sometimes, uh, you know, traffic isn't real safe when they're driving real fast. The fine for texting and driving can be anywhere from $20 to $500. In few states, it can also get up to $1,000. In Alaska, texting and driving is a misdemeanor criminal offense that could come with a year of jail time and a $10,000 fine. Distracted driving has become a leading cause of vehicle crashes in the U.S. Do you text and drive while other people are in the car? While other people are in the car, no. No. But I do text and drive sometimes. In 2020, 396 people in total were killed as a direct result of accidents caused by texting and driving. That amounts to more than one death per day. The number of people who are caught texting and driving each year is staggering. Do you text and drive? Um, to be honest, if I've been at a stop sign, I'll look and see where my message is from. But if I'm driving, I don't touch my phone at all. It's a pole. <laughs> Hey Kelly, does your mom know where we're going? No, can someone text her? I will. 